Hi, I'm gonna make this video. Oh, this is a small tree prong. I'm gonna dig it. I'm gonna get the root out and I'll show you how to identify this root versus uh, one that's uh, not a real ginseng root. So, there's a lot of people who like the weeds younger generation growing up uh they don't know what it is but i learned when i was growing up when i'd find something i thought was ginseng my dad always brought uh roots in and i always remembered what that root looked like so i would uh <clears throat> dig it if i thought it was it and see if it was ginseng <laughs> so finally i've dug enough to I learned what it was, what it looked like, the tops. So, so that's that's three prong. It's a small one, but uh, I'm gonna dig the root. If the root ain't no good, I'll I'll just bury it back. But it's already reproduced. Right there's a seed pod that's come off of it. But I'll get right back on here in just a minute. I dug that root. It looked like something another had eat on it, and uh, it continued to grow. You can see the curls there on it. How many times it came up? But it was a good root, which is underneath that log right there. So I don't know if something lived under there or what, but it ate through the side of that root, and it grew kind of odd, but. And right here, I got some root that came up with that. Hmm. A lot of times you'll lose the top. The top will come off, and you just dig them down, and you find the root. If you know what the root looks like. That right there, some may have put that in their bag for ginseng. Uh, which you usually don't put roots that small in there no way but just saying and there's another piece of that same root not ginseng recognizing the root as a 